June 2022 witnessed some masterclass performances by some of the men who live by the gloves. Stephen Fulton dominated Danny Roman to pick a unanimous victory over him and to retain the WBC and WBL Junior Featherweight titles. Devin Haney staked his WBC title in pursuit of the WBA Super, IBF and WBO lightweight titles that were held by George Cambosis Jr. After 12 rounds of back and forth action, Devin Haney picked a unanimous victory, becoming the first undisputed lightweight champion since 1990. Noahio Inoa Sokum Nonita Donare in round two of their bout, going home with the WBC title, in addition to its WBA and IBF titles. Otto Betabiev successfully unified the WBA, WBC and IBF belts of the light heavyweight division after knocking out Joe Smith in round two. Daniel Dubois knocked out Travor Brand in round four to win the WBA regular heavyweight. Daniel, who took out Brian with a left hook, says he is ready to take on the left hook master Dillian White, who in April lost a WBC World Heavyweight title match to Tyson Fury. In what looked like the fastest finish of the month, Vidal really concludes Jones Valuev with a left hook in the first round of their six round bout. Chris Congo took Sebastian Formella the distance to pick a unanimous victory. Joe Kadina won IBF Super Featherweight title, taking out the Japanese Kenchi Ogawa in round two. Richard Greg Pohe moved closer to IBF closer with world title opportunity after stopping Fabio Tucci in the second round with a vicious body shot. In a minute 50 seconds of round eight, the current youngest world champion, Jesse Rodriguez, tapped Shrisake Sor making a successful first defense of his WBC Super Flyweight title. Earlier, he had knocked down the tie twice at the Techport Arena in San Antonio, Texas venue of the belt. Moronjon at Madelia's work over Ronnie Royce was not as easy as Rodriguez's ever saw. Akmadelia had to gracefully switch it out for 12 rounds before his aggression in the penultimate minute of the last round of the match crumbled rears effectively, ensuring that Akmadelia retained his IBF and WBA junior featherweight title via a technical knockout victory. Feeling outclassed and outburged by Jessica Makarski, Alma Ibarra refused to continue action in round 5, giving McCaskill a RTD victory. With the victory, Jessica McCaskill effectively retained her six welterweight world titles and her status as the undisputed welterweight champion of the world. Life is a bad. Protect yourself at all times. Fight hard, fight clean.